that you confirm and want to rely on the affidavit that you have filed. Yes, I confirm. And that you remember on the 7th of November 2023, you took the same stand and testified before this assembly as a mover, correct? Yes, I confirm. And you remember a question was put to you whether or not the impeachment then was politically instigated, correct? Yes. Do you recall your answers? I may not recall the exact answer. I'll give you the answer. Honorable Speaker, I'm referring to the hands of this House at page 53, dated 7th of November. Mr. Mudombi Thionkulu was the lead counsel then, correct? Yes. And you remember him putting this question to you, and you answered in negative that it was not politically instigated. You remember? You recall or you do not recall, Mr. Witness? I don't recall reading for me the, the answer, maybe. You remember Mr. Mudombi asking you whether it is true from the governor's allegations that the impeachment was politically instigated, and your answer was Evans Mawera Karia. Uh, Ka Ka you said it was not true. Have I now refreshed your memories? From the records, yes. Do you still want to hold that preposition? Of course, uh, everything that was in that you motion want to was still not hold, Excuse me, Mr. Witness, I want a yes or a no answer. Do you still want to hold that preposition or do you want to run away from it? As a then, I hold that position. You hold that position? Yes. What has now changed? So many things. The one, that you are not no longer the leader of the majority in the no, assembly. No, no, no. Yes. Number two? Uh, the governor reached out and called for reconciliation. I did a lot of soul searching. Thank you. I, I have, consulted widely. It's okay. Don't answer questions that I have not put to you. You have testified in lay at length how people were induced to bring this to bring that particular motion, correct? Yes, and I have stated the facts. That is a motion that you brought on the seventh of November, correct? Yes. So you brought motion out of ulterior motives of being induced as at then, correct? According to the circumstances then. You allowed yourself to be induced, yes? As per the circumstances then. So on that day when you took the stand on the 7th of November 2023, you did not speak the truth to this at Senate, but you spoke out of inducement, correct? I'm saying as Correct as or not correct? I want an point. answer, not a vague answer. Correct or not correct? Not correct. So then were you induced that particular time from your evidence? I've narrated all the events that led to one the of the events, Mr. Witness, was that you are induced, correct? One of the events is that you are induced. I, said you, I didn't say you are induced, I said you are mobilized according to party lines. How are you mobilized? Of course, I stated that we met as the leadership of For financial gains, correct? Including 20,000 shillings that you are given, correct? That was later. After okay. the after but you the remember second the Christmas gift, correct? After the second impeachment that failed in the in the Senate. You remember the Christmas gift, yes? I'm saying later after the second impeachment that failed in the Senate. You received a gift. Yes. For the work well done, correct? A Christmas gift for a work well done. Christmas was done, not even uh, it was Christmas was on coming. So Mr. Witness if you allowed yourself to be induced that particular time to bring that particular impeachment motion, how truthful is your statement today? I was not induced. I said we were mobilized on party lines. On party lines? Yes. So you, which party do you belong to? UDA. UDA. Yes. So UDA mobilized its MCAs to bring the motion? UDA at the county level, Meru county level, mobilize the MCAs to introduce an impeachment motion. Does that mean that the UDA party is against the governor or was against the governor? I stated in my statement. Does that mean at that particular time the UDA party was against the at governor? At the county level, yes. Nationally, the Secretary General had stated that that was not the party position. Which other party was against the governor as at then? Uh, the parties that were mobilized, we have Bas Party, we have uh, PNU, we have Jubilee, and other assembly parties. You spoke about receiving 80,000 shillings. You correct? You remember? Facilitation to be in the Senate. Who gave these 80,000 shillings? It was paid from the assembly. It was paid from the assembly. Did you receive or did you partake of it? Yes, I received. 
and it was a motivation for you to appear, correct? It was facilitation to be in the Senate for the five days that we were here. A facilitation? Yes. Today, have you been facilitated? I've seen that we have received a message. Today, have you been facilitated? Facilitation, yes, we have been facilitated, but it has not already been paid. But it will be paid because we have received a message from the clerk saying that members will be facilitated for five days to be in the Senate. Notwithstanding whether or not you appear for Governor Kawira as a witness or a witness for the, Senate, uh, for the Assembly. Witness for the Governor. The County Assembly has equally facilitated you, correct? I will receive that message. That you will receive your per DMs for, for participating? Y yes, yes. So it was usual for the County Assembly to facilitate its members? For the previous one, only 59 members were facilitated. Masking, it is usual for the County Assembly to facilitate its members, correct? Because today you have received a message that you receive facilitation, correct? Yes, we have received the message. And therefore the County Assembly considers its members as equal, correct? No, no, no. Um, Mr. Witness, I want to refer you to your affidavit. But before I refer you to this affidavit, have you critically read the motion before this assembly for the impeachment of the governor? I've gone through the motion. Have you answered those allegations in your state, in your, um, in your affidavit? And if yes, kindly point us to us, point to us the particular paragraph that answers to the allegations. The particular allegations? Excuse me, just take your affidavit, take it. And lead the Senate to the particular paragraph that has responded to issue number one. Issue number one, where have you responded? Just a minute. I've responded to the issue of uh, money that was raised for the... Not the money that was raised, the issue of illegal revocation. Where have you responded to it in your affidavit? I have not, I've not responded to it in that affidavit. You have not responded to it. Issue number two, where have you responded to it? I've stated... Do you know what issue number two is all about? Yes, yes. Show us a particular paragraph that responds to those allegations. Number 23. Paragraph 23. Yes, paragraph Read 23. Read out. That the clerk of the assembly, under the instructions of the speaker, has been writing several letters to frustrate the approval of the governor's nominees for the bonds of various semi-autonomous government agencies. The clerk has no role. Do you have evidence in that respect? It is in the governor's uh, battery. Were you aware of this frustration by the, the, sec, the clerk before you came to this assembly? Yes, I was aware because when those... Uh, you were aware, thank you. Yes. Did you take any actions to curtail these frustrations? Yes, I did. What did you do? When these uh, uh, letters came... Where is the evidence in your affidavit? <laughs> it is not what in the affidavit, you, but the personally evidence? I gave my opinion in a meeting I'm not, I'm that not was asking, discussing I'm not these asking about nominees. You. Mr. Witness, please listen. I'm not asking you to give us your opinion. You've given so many of them. So we do not want to entertain any further opinion. Okay. We want to go to the facts. Okay. Where, where have you pleaded in your affidavit that you took actions against the clerk for frustrating the works of the governor? I didn't take any action against the clerk, but I have responded to that uh, count number two. Yes? I didn't take any action, you but in my affidavit I have responded Show to that. in your affidavit where you've responded to issue number three. And I have the affidavit. And I put it to you that issue number three, number 23, does not respond to the, uh, to the allegations contained in the notice of motion, issue number two. Sorry? I put it to you that paragraph 23 of your affidavit is not a response and is not evidence that relates to the allegations of failing to appoint chairpersons. I don't agree to that. Let us go to issue number three and point us in your affidavit where you have responded to it. I have not responded to issue number Thank three. Thank you. Let us go to paragraph to issue number four. Point us in our affidavit, in your affidavit where you have responded to it. I have responded to it where I stated that I am aware that count was initially in the previous impeachment motions. Where in, you, in your paragraph?
and is the issue in, our, in, para, in illegal dismissing about the issue of dismissing or the issue of the expenditure of county money. The governor dismissing individuals and making the county accrue unnecessary resources paid to the litigants. Did if, you understand? If I, can read, if I can read the crowd, it's illegally dismissing in bold. Yes. In bold. And illegally then, dismissing. Yes. And then narration continues. As a consequence of? Illegally dismissing. And as a consequence thereof, what happened? A loss. A loss of how much? Four million. Where is that in your affidavit? I've said uh, I responded. Don't it's not in my affidavit. It's not in your affidavit. Yes. Let us go to issue number, count number two, gross misconduct. Yes? Deliberately misleading the county, as, uh, the, 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 the members of the public. Yes? That's in the barrier of Sniper, eight, 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 six million was raised, correct? Yes. You are aware of those utterances, correct? Yes, I'm aware. That the same were done by the governor, yes? Yes, I'm aware. And that it was done in public, correct? Yes. And that there was a pay bill that was generated for that purposes, yes? Yes. And that in the said pay bill, it's only 286, 516,000 that was donated, correct? According to uh, the assembly's evidence. According to the assembly's evidence. Yes. Do you have any contra evidence to that averment? Yes, in my statement, I have stated. Statement. Please lead us to that paragraph. Lead us to that particular paragraph. Just a minute. You are also aware that the governor made averments and allegations that the wife, the, the wife, the window to the sniper has moved on with another MCA, correct? I'm not aware of that. They're not aware. Kindly, let's pray video 1A and 1B in our, in our videos. You yourself, did you changa to that particular pay bill? Yes, no, no, not to the pay bill. How did, how did you changa? Through the WhatsApp group in the Cretan for the assembly members. How was the money collected? It was collected through a, a member of the assembly. Through a member of the assembly? Yes. Through who? Which member? A um, member of a county assembly known as Sarah Gaki. Honorable Sarah Gaki. Is it true that the wife of the deceased sniper moved on with an MCA? I'm not aware. Did you see her testifying yesterday? Uh, I didn't watch the... Are you aware that she was a witness? Sorry? Are you aware that she was a witness? Yes, I'm aware she was a witness. Did you follow through her evidence? I didn't follow. All right. As we wait for the playing of those videos, you have indicated before this assembly that one of the frustrations that you colluded to undertake was to make sure that the governor was frustrated in the feeding program, correct? Yes. And that frustration was actualized according to your evidence, correct? Yes. How was it actualized? Through a motion in the assembly, a report of a committee. Through a motion, correct? Yes. So it is in your evidence that that program is no longer running, correct? It was stopped. It was stopped. Mr. Witness, I refer you and I refer the senators to our further um, bundle of volume six, Volume 6, at page 83. At page 83. Yes. 